hey guys welcome back to our channel so in today's video i will be showing you guys exactly what i have in my makeup bag so i saw a couple of videos of people showing what they have in their makeup bag and i just wanted to show you guys what i have in my makeup bag every time i get a new makeup bag i feel like the bag gets bigger and bigger and bigger so this year my makeup bag is all in this one right here so I do carry a lot of stuff in there, but it's not a lot. And I did my makeup today too. So like I kind of wanted to show you like, you know, cause I did my makeup today. So um, let me know if you like this look. I really like these eyes, like these, like pinky Valentine vibes. You know what I mean? With the white eyeliner. So yeah, I just decided um, that I wanted to film this video and show you guys what I carry in my bag. So stay tuned. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel um, and give this video a thumbs up. I actually got this makeup bag as a present. So my sister was the one that actually gave me this bag. So this is the one that she gave me. If my sister is watching this, shout out to my sister. I feel like it's, you know, like a normal size makeup bag. I don't think it's freaking huge, but like if... I sit back and look at the other makeup bags I had. I used to only carry a couple of things and now I carry everything. But I mean, it's more convenient for me because with the stuff I have here, I can do like mostly any look that I want to do. Now, there is some stuff that I feel like in here are missing that, I, you know, I just haven't put them in. But I, so I'm just going to stop blabbering and I'm going to show you guys. The first thing I want to show you is I do carry my Jaclyn Hill palette. If you do not have this palette, you are not living. I absolutely love this palette. The reason why I carry this palette though also is because um, you can do any makeup look with this palette. You know, any makeup look, any makeup look that you would come would come to your mind, you can do with this palette, of course, you know. I've used it a lot. I really, 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 really love this. It's really pigmented. I really love this palette. So so the next thing also, um, I have this highlighting palette and this is from Makeup Revolution. I really like this palette. Okay, so you see that highlight right there on my cheek? That highlight is from this. I use two of these sh um, shades of highlight. You can see it on my nose too. Those are the shades I use for my highlight today for this look. Another thing I carry in here also is this Wander Beauty um, Trip for Two Blush and Contour Duo. This is what I use um, to look, one, look at myself, and then two, for blush and contour. So this is what I use. So another thing I carry is my foundation. So I use only two foundations because, you know, I'm really not like that much of a full coverage person. I like, I just feel like I like what I like. And so one of the, my foundations is the Maybelline Fit Me Foundation Dewy Plus Smooth in the shade 110. So I am 110 in this shade. I'm actually wearing that foundation right now. So this is one of my favorite foundations that I like to wear. I also like the Estee Lauder, the powder foundation. Um, I also like that one, but I like this one. So I carry this one around in my bag as well. Another thing I carry, you know, you can't forget your eyelash curler. I do carry an eyelash curler, which is right here. Um, I think I got this at CVS. I think, I'm not sure, but I do carry this in here whenever I'm going to do my lashes. I have brushes in here that I carry two. These are two. I use this one for contour. Um, for contour, and since I lost my beauty sponge, um, I use this also for um, powder. Oops. So I did get these two in a boxy charm also. So I use this one for my foundation and then I use this one for contour. So these are two of the brushes that I use. Of course, I have my Becca um, Hydra Mist Set and Refresh Powder. I love this. This also came in the boxy charm. So, you know, I really liked it and um you know I've I'm almost done with it so I really like this powder 
for setting powder. I really like this powder. Another thing, I I don't really use these lashes, but I do carry a little box of lashes because I put the lashes that I'm done wearing, I put them in here, and I just carry them instead of carrying like the whole thing of the lashes. So I do carry this in here as well. Okay, so the next thing I have, oh, this is another brush. You know, this is um, a BH Cosmetics brush. And this brush I actually use to take off all the powder. Whenever I'm done, I use this big buddy right here. And I just, you know, clean all the brushes off. I mean, I take all the powder off that's on my face. I use that brush to do that with. And then I also carry my contour stick. So I actually got this from Wet n Wild. I got it from Walmart. I really like this contouring stick. Now I don't really use the, um, I think it's, what is it? This is supposed to be a highlight. I don't use it. I only use the contour one and I really like this. It's affordable and I really like it. I really like it. So I use this as contour. Here's another. I wanted to show you. These are um, the lashes I'm wearing. It comes in a pack of three. I really like these lashes. And they last me a long time. Especially if you take care of them. And you get a lot of wears out of these. So these are from my Laura, of course. And I put these in here. Because those are the ones that I was going to put on today. Another thing um, I carry in here. I'm not going in order. I'm just showing you whatever comes out of my hand. Um, I do have some more brushes. Um, these are from BH Cosmetics. I use this one um, when I use my highlight. And then I use this one, this one right here, if I'm going to do like a cut crease or anything. This flat head right here. This, These are the brushes that I use for that stuff. I do carry this Victoria's Secret Love. I think this is, is, is this Bombshell? No it's love oh my god this smells so good if you have not smelled this i recommend for you to smell this it's so delicious it smells so pretty i really like the smell of this one so another thing i carry is this milani and luminoso powder baked powder blush so this is another blush that i use so this is what it looks like it's really cute and it gives you like a little highlight as well and it, this is what i used on my cheeks today so i have a lot of stuff in here um for concealer i i remember i did not i was not a fan of this concealer but what i did is you know i gave it a second or third chance i don't know how many chances this is the elf 16 hour camel concealer in the shade fair warm oh my god i love this concealer but i would use it with a beauty sponge and other products i would try to use other brushes to blend it out but girl oh my god it was so hard so what i found so what i found is that this brush actually works this is the boxycharm brush this um brush was what i found um really easy to work with when i use that concealer um and i really liked it because you know i thought that that concealer you know i, I saw everybody bragging about it that it was really good but i was like i really don't like it because it dries really quick you know and it was the um type of brush and type of sponge that i was using so i started using this and oh my god i really like it now so um i did try it out i gave it a second chance next thing i'm gonna show you is this is my um blush brush so this i actually got this is one that i think this is from the walmart brand if i remember correctly i think this is from the walmart brand walmart brand and i mean you know i really like it and you could tell it's like pink because of the blush but um this is what i use for my blush i was telling you earlier that i like the estee lauder powder foundation so this is the one i use this is a double wear stay in place powder makeup two in one desert beige i am really light so that's why you know my foundation is gonna be light i like that it has a mirror and i've hit pan on this foundation because i love this foundation i cannot express to you how much i love this foundation i've I love it. The moment I tried this foundation, I've only stuck to this powder foundation and then they came out with liquid and I got into liquid. But I love this, especially for the summer. You don't want to look really cakey. So I love this foundation. I love this one. A lipstick. And this is from... Oops. I think this is a Rimmel. Yeah, Rimmel London. Um, Stay Matte Liquid Lip Color. And this is like a plum color. It's... The shade in this is 
plum this show it's a really it's not super dark but it, it's not like this color um but this is more like a purpley reddish i really like these um they do tend to have a long wear on them so i i like that of course this is just another um this is from wet and wild actually this is just another blending brush that um i have in here so this is another one one of the um eyeliners that i've liked i've never i've never been a fan of a marker eyeliner i tried a lot of them and i did not like them so that's why i didn't try them again but i came to love this kat von d tattoo liner waterproof eyeliner in the shade trooper black oh my god i love this eyeliner now this is all the eyeliner I wear now. So like whenever I do my wing or whatever, this is the only eyeliner I use. So I really like that. Another thing is I carry my primer. I love it. Touch and Soul comes out with really good primers. If you want to try them, I love this primer. This is the glassy one. They have another one in the tube. I think it's called like Touch and Soul Prime Essentials oil i think i don't remember i i love touch and souls primers they are really good and i just really love them another thing i carry here is my color pop highlighter in the shade flex Terrian. oh my god this highlighter is really good and affordable too i recommend this um highlighter this is from ColourPop. Um, I like this highlighter too, so I carry it in here. Well, other things, uh, this is my eyelash glue that I use. I've tried a lot of eyelash glues and I really like the brand Kiss. This one is really good and affordable too. I recommend that one to use when you're putting lashes. Here's another lipstick from Rimmel London and this is in the shade Troublemaker. This is a really pretty dark nude oh my god i love this one too i love a lot of stuff i know you know i just carry a lot of stuff in here there's another one and this is a, by again rimmel london and this is a shade midnight so if you're looking for a darker one this is super like purple like dark purple I also have carry this one, you know, I carry, I have that one, and I think if I'm not mistaken, I have a black one too. Yeah, so these two are um, eyelash glue, also I carry a black one. I used to be a fan of this one, but then they came out with the one that I showed you earlier, the little tube one, wherever it went. Um, this tube one i fell in love with this one so i kind of stopped using this one but i do wear this one um like whenever I, I don't do eyeliner i do wear the clear one and when you do eyeliner you want to wear a black one so it matches in with your you don't have to but i mean you know if you want to you can use a black one so i do also carry these in here you know just for backup because you never know when your lash is going to come off for my eyes today, like I showed you guys earlier, I did use this Ace Beauty. Um, sorry, it was upside down. This Ace Beauty um, Glimmer Shadow in the shade Cotton Candy. And this is just what I use. So I basically just use this like with my finger. I did not apply any um, anything to it. I just put it right here. And what I use, just a darker shadow right here. I just used it um from the jaclyn hill palette That's what i came up with with my look today i think it's really cute really like you know nice so i did use this one on my eyes today so i did get that in my boxy charm as well um here's another brush too this is uh, from lexi brushes lexi it's from lexi brushes and i told you this one comes with like a pack of three so i do like to keep those in my bag well the last thing i like to carry i have a funny story with this so when me and my boyfriend back in like september when we ever went to miami you know it was hot so you know <sighs> It was hot, so I really told him I felt really nauseous. So what I told him is I needed a fan. So we actually got this fan in Miami. So what I actually use it for when I get nauseous now or like whenever I put my setting spray, which I just realized I don't have my setting spray in here. When I use my setting spray, I just use this to, you know, make it dry. 
So I do use this fan in here. So I do keep a fan in here. That was it for my video. I just wanted to show you guys, you know, just some things that were in my makeup bag. Um, everyone carries different things. That's just what I carry in mind. Um, if you want to know more details about a product that I shared with you, just let me, don't, let me know in the comments below. And um, yeah, so don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. And we'll see you guys on the next one.